name is Nell and I'm a double amputee mother of four. I'm a boy mom of four, twin boys and one middle and the last one. I mean the last one. When I say the last one, by the way, I don't mean that this is my last baby. I mean that this was the last one born. <laughs> In this channel, I my, my goal is to inspire a lot of people to see that even without your legs, you can do stuff, you can cook, you can take care of your children. Because some people, believe it or not, they actually think that I rely on my husband for everything. I do not. So, I was born in a country called Botswana. I'm a Botswana, I'm a Botswana girl. By the way, people from Botswana are called Botswana, not Botswanian. And I grew up there. So what I did was that I went to university college in Canada and then I visited a friend in America and that's when I met my husband. And he clicked and we got married and here we are with four children. I went to college at Carlton University. That's where I went to university in Ottawa. Ottawa, they say Ottawa, I call it Ottawa. If you hear my accent, it's from a country called Botswana, the southern part of Africa. A lot of people like to come and say, Neo, are you from South Africa? Because South Africa, Lesotho, Botswana, we have the same accent. So we speak the same. So a lot of times you don't know, is this from Botswana? Is this person from South Africa? Or is this person from Lesotho? And no, I'm not from Lesotho. And no, I'm not from South Africa. I am from Botswana, which is still in South Africa. <laughs> So yeah, I hope that I inspire you. One of the questions that I like to receive is how do you get the confidence to get out? Has it always been like this? The answer is no. I actually used to be shy, but I'm a believer in the Lord Jesus Christ. And as I keep on reading the Bible and learning who I am in Christ, I have learned to know that the person that I care who thinks about me is the Christ. And not only that, I have had parents that have the same, that their children have the same thing. And they show their children my videos and say that, you see, she can do it, you can do it. So I've inspired a lot of people and I'm happy. I have over 300 subscribers on YouTube. I have over 200 followers on TikTok. I have over 400 followers on Instagram and now almost 200 followers on Facebook. This has been such a very big deal for me. And as you see, my baby, when I talk, he just wants this. I go back. You want ugly money. You want ugly money. When I talk to other people, he knows. Yeah. It's a boy. I'm a boy mom. Did I say that? So I'm hoping that I'm inspiring you to also stand out there. Don't be scared of what people think about you. I mean, I receive a lot of rude comments, but they don't stop me. So I'm hoping that I'm inspiring you. If I am, make sure that you follow me and like, and you can share this video if it inspires you. It means a lot. And yeah, that's what I do. And I, 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 my baby is like, so I'm going to be posting a lot of short videos like this as an inspiration and hopefully to inspire you to do something. We, um, just like go out there and do something good, you know? I mean, inspirational. Um, there's a lot of negativity already in this life. There's a lot of depressions. There's a lot of sicknesses. There's a lot of death. There's a lot of gloominess. So sometimes we need a little light there. So go out there and be a light for someone's life. You never know. You may change someone's life, actually. And I'm so thankful that I was able to change a lot of people's lives. So, yeah. <laughs> yes, a 200 followers. Yeah. I mean, 200. Thousand. Yeah. I mean, that's a lot of, you see, that's a big number, actually. Yeah. <laughs> so see you in the next video.